You may know the origin of the 21-gun salute was determined by adding the individual digits of 1776. I would like to share with you why the flag is folded 13 times when it is lowered or when it is folded and handed to the survivor at the burial of the veteran. The first fold of our flag is a symbol of life. The second fold is a symbol of our belief in the eternal life. The third fold is made in honor and remembrance of the veteran departing our ranks who gave a portion of life for the defense of our country to attain a peace throughout the world. The fourth fold represents our weaker nature for as American citizens trusted in God, it is to him we turn in times of peace as well as in times of war for his divine guidance. The fifth fold is a tribute to our country for in the words of Stephen Decatur, our country in dealing with other countries, may she always be right but it is still our country, right or wrong. The sixth fold is for where our hearts lie. It is with our heart that we pledge allegiance to the flag of the United States of America and to the republic for which it stands, one nation, under God, indivisible, with liberty and justice for all. The seventh fold is a tribute to our armed forces, for it is through the armed forces that we protect our country and our flag against all our enemies, whether they be found within or without the boundaries of our republic. The eighth fold is a tribute to the one who entered into the valley of the shadow of death, that we might see the light of day, and to honor mother for whom it flies on Mother's Day. The ninth fold is a tribute to womanhood, for it has been through their faith, love, loyalty, and devotion that the character of the men and women who have made this country great have been molded. The tenth fold is a tribute to father, for he too has given his sons and daughters for the defense of our country since they were first born. The 11th fold, in the eyes of a Hebrew citizen, represents the lower portion of the seal of King David and King Solomon and glorifies in their eyes the God of Abraham, Isaac, and Jacob. The 12th fold, in the eyes of a Christian citizen, represents an emblem of eternity and glorifies in their eyes God the Father, the Son, and Holy Ghost. When the flag is completely folded, the stars are uppermost, reminding us of our national motto, in God we trust. After the flag is completely folded and tucked in, it takes on the appearance of a cocked hat, ever reminding us of the soldiers who served under General George Washington and the sailors and Marines who served under Captain John Paul Jones, who were followed by their comrades and shipmates and the armed forces of the United States, preserving for us the rights, privileges, and freedoms we enjoy today. Ashton, on behalf of the President of the United States of America, the people of a grateful nation, Please accept this flag as a token of appreciation for the honorable and faithful service rendered to this nation after 30 years of condolences.
On behalf of my brothers here with the Patriot Guard, it's our sincere honor to be here in the presence of the family and to pay honor and patronage to our fallen hero. We want to thank you from the bottom of our hearts and we wish our share our condolences and we want to thank you and God bless you. In the great book of Philippians 4.13, as we all can do, we can do all things through Christ Jesus who strengthens us. And that, I would leave you with that. Uh, on the departing of our services today, our Patriot Guard is going to render our one last flag line. And uh, we want to just say thank you again. We really appreciate it. And we really appreciate all of you. Thanks for being here. Sure. 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 Sure.